Hi, Cancer. It's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's see what's going on with you in love, Cancer. All right. Oh, okay. Um, somebody could be spying on you or you spying on them. There's no communication between you and this person. Just a lot of anxiety in terms of should I, you know, the shoulda, coulda, wouldas, and should I respond or not respond, but should I reach out? Somebody wants to reconcile. Somebody's like, how do we figure out how to work together or come together? Somebody could be wondering if you have moved on, Cancer, or vice versa. Let's see. What's the love message for Cancer? All right, past life. So this is somebody you have history with, okay? This is someone who you... Um, you met in this lifetime, it, it, it could be that you were to stay together, be together, or just come together, learn something, and move on, okay? Um, but your soul knows this person. Um, it's like a soulmate type of energy. You do have history with whomever this is. True gem. All right, do expect the unexpected here uh, from the least expected person. Um with the true gem here, it says surprise, the element of surprise. It also can even talk about an engagement ring. Maybe somebody wants to marry you. You hear news of someone getting married. Um, do expect the unexpected here, but there is a surprise. Okay, that card, wonderful about dating. Okay, so you definitely can hear of somebody um, getting married or getting engaged that you're dating. Or No, I feel like this is somebody else, okay? Um, someone that maybe you were keeping an eye on, this person could be dating and now they could be getting engaged. Um, there could, there is someone that maybe you could be dating and, um, wallflower, mature woman, destiny. So it looks like the universe is going to play a part in whatever's going on here for you, uh, cancer. It looks like... Some of you are involved in a karmic situation here. Something that is not supposed to last forever. Learn your lesson, move on, okay? Um, but it looks like there will be some unexpected energy. Something, an unexpected event, an unexpected gift, an unexpected something that comes in and it sparks up maybe um, the opportunity for you to date this person again. This is an energy of a wallflower, a mature woman, destiny. It says that somebody's not getting out there. Oh. Some of you, you were dating somebody and they wanted to marry you. Then you start dating someone else or they started dating someone else. But now there's an energy of somebody not even getting out there and dating anymore. Not even dressing up and getting out there. Destiny is going to play a part in this universe. Maybe in bringing you and someone from your past life back together. The two of you, it looks like you started dating other people or looking at other options. But this could be a karmic situation here where... Um, Y'all had something to learn. What is the future energy here? It also could be same sex for some of you. What is the future energy? What's the future energy? Future energy. Do expect the unexpected. Maybe even a message coming into you. Good news message. Maybe in seven days, seven weeks. Typically talks about seven days. Wow, great fortune. Yeah, it looks like somebody from your past, I don't know if you're going to reach out to them or they're reaching out to you, um, but it looks like you guys start dating again. And it also could read that some of you have a lot of options, but you want this one person and vice versa. They feel that way about you. Wow, sudden wealth. It's like when you and this person come back together or get together, uh, yeah, it's the this is this is major. When you get these two cards together, it talks about major energy. 
it talks about a lot. You got seven here and then you got seven here. So, um, it says right path too. It also says guidance, mastery of maybe even magic. Somebody also could be doing magic in terms of it or just energy. Um, trying to bring someone else back in or bring them back. You've got very interesting reading there. Uh, cancer it looks like. If you don't want someone from the past, then it's not from you, not for you. But if you do, then it looks like somebody from the past could be resurfacing uh, by way of the, uni the universe. Um, you also could have, you know, asked for this. Let's see. What is career and finance for a cancer? Uh, the five of air. So there could be an air of jealousy around you. People jealous, playing mind games. Somebody's trying to win or one up you. You may have gotten something, done something king of fire yeah you could be the boss or the entrepreneur or uh, you do your own thing you bring in your own money there could be some unexpected money unexpected luck good fortune especially in your own business do expect unexpected money the queen of air and the six of pentacles here you definitely are the boss here the executive you make the last call the last the final call in terms of um, decision making here with the six of earth, you try to do what's best for everyone involved uh, and try to give what is needed. You also could be giving into um, a situation. You could be putting a lot of time, energy, effort into something and feel like you're not making enough money. You kind of burnt out and you feel like you need to put up some boundaries in terms of this job because it's unfulfilling. It may be even tiresome. You could feel trapped. Like you could feel like you've hit the, the the glass ceiling. There's no further to go, but you don't know how to walk away. You don't know where to go. It says the grass is greener on the other side, but there's a maybe a lack of money, energy, fear. Not lack of fear, but there is fear. It says you need to come out of that. There could be good news about money or you just need to be more consistent in terms of starting something and in terms of saving for the future in terms of these plans that you have for yourself they they have to be practical it, it can't be just wishful thinking Make something happen because it looks like, and see something through. Make it happen and stick with it and see something through here. There could be a loss of a job for some of you, but there's something else coming behind it. Some of you are the manager, supervisor, boss, entrepreneur, business owner. You make the, the, the final call here, um, but you could be doing a lot are giving so much, but you don't feel like um, you're getting enough back from this job, this business, whatever it may be. You don't know how to walk away from it. You've also given so much time to it. You don't know if you want, you don't know if you want, you don't know where to go. You don't know where to start. Some of you want to start your own thing, but you don't know, you're not focused, you lack focus. You have insight, you have idea, but you lack focus and you lack direction and you lack consistency. Some of you need to start saving more or better, saving for that rainy day. All right, so that's what I have for you, Cancer. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section, okay? Uh, thank you for being here. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Keep in mind that you can learn the tarot with me. Take tarot classes. The link is below. And if you feel like you want to purchase something for the channel, you can. The Amazon wish list is linked below also. Uh, thank you, Cancer. Many blessings to you. Take care.